Hey guys, what's going on and welcome to day 16 of 22 days of lipstick and for today's video Now this has been requested a couple of times and there was supposed to be another lipstick in its place I had to literally shove it off and here we are So I am going to be doing a lip swatch and a review of the Mars Cosmetics matte lip crayon Now I have picked out four shades as always check the description box below to see the shade names and for foundation shade reference I'm NC40 in MAC now if you have not already ready then do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it to be notified whenever i upload and now let's jump right in the video Okay, so first let's talk about the features of these lip crayons. Now it says that it is an ultra matte, so it gives a smooth matte finish look. Highly pigmented, delivers high pigmented color which lasts for hours. Skin perfecting formula, so it masks unevenness of lips and looks perfect. Lightweight finish, it spreads like heaven on your lips and does not feel heavy. And it's for all skin types? Skin types? Lip crayons? Okay. Okay, so soft textured lip color is infused with emollients which provides moisture to your lips. Now these are priced at 229 rupees for 3.5 grams of product and they offer a total of 12 shades. So this is how the lip crayon looks like which comes in this matte black finish with white writing at the bottom it is color coordinated with a transparent cap and you have the shade name and number at the side as well and this is how the lip crayon looks like and now let's finally move on to the lip swatches. All right, so let's talk about the formula of these lip crayons. Now, firstly, these are extremely pigmented and with just one layer, you're good to go. You do not have to add like a second layer or do any touch up of that sorts. And these are quick drying as well. So you have to work a bit quickly with these lip crayons. Now, these lip crayons are like a pure matte formula which settles into a matte finish. And since it is so matte, you may have to drag your lips a little bit when you're filling it in. So just FYI on that and also these are very light on the lips it doesn't feel heavy or it doesn't feel like you're wearing any lipstick at all these are transfer proof smudge proof and mask friendly as well and this is how it looks like after you have a very heavy meal now coming to the longevity of these lip crayons i will talk about that like in a minute so just put a pin on it and lastly for the removal of these lip crayons you can use like a wet wipe but there's a lot of pulling and tugging so i would highly suggest like a micellar water or the best would be an oil based product. Now before we can get into the cons, there are a few FYIs and the first point is that these are like I mentioned before a pure matte finish so it could be a bit drying on the lips. For me right now I have added some lip balm underneath and then I've applied these lip crayons. It still feels very comfortable and it is still very light. Uh, the second point is that these do emphasize the wrinkles and the texture on your lips. For me personally that's not like a con and it's not a problem for me but for some of them it could be so yeah that's that. And the last point is that these do not have any fragrance or any smell. 
So I forgot to mention that the shade 02 I am strong and 05 I've got this is almost identical. So if you're looking into any of those two shades, just pick any one and uh, yeah. And now coming to the cons, there is one big fat con and unfortunately it has to do with the formula and in turn with the longevity as well. Now hear me out i did specify that these are comfortable very lightweight on the lips it doesn't feel like anything on your lips at all yes that is all true however when you press your lips together and rub it it starts becoming grainy and it starts fading away which is very weird now yesterday i was testing these out and i was just doing my office work and i was in deep thoughts i just pressed my lips it started feeling kind of powdery so i kept rubbing my lips together it sounds so weird but it when i did that it started becoming all grainy and the color just started fading away so that is extremely weird i even tried with a different shade same thing happened i even asked my mother to try it out and with her i asked her to like wait for like five to ten minutes and then try same thing happened now i will also insert a video just to quickly show you guys what exactly i'm talking about now personally i do not prefer any of my lipsticks doing this because in my whole collection there are just very 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 few matte liquid lipsticks where this has happened but that is after having a very heavy meal or something very oily but this is weird because it just happens on its own by just rubbing my lips together even after five minutes or even after like one hour and it just starts fading away so yeah that is a big con for me now i was just almost wrapping up my video and then i realized a quick solution for the con that i just mentioned a few seconds back and that is to use a lip balm underneath and then using the lip crayon then it does not become grainy or sandy or it does not like fade away but i will still keep the point as it is that these are a con because the formula is like that of the lip crayon and there should not be like a roundabout way to fix it so yeah i just wanted to let you guys know on that so yeah guys these were my thoughts on the mars cosmetics matte lip crayons and this wraps today's video you guys i hope you all enjoyed it if you did do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified whenever i upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or requests i will try my best for you as well as follow me on my socials which is it's channel on instagram and it's channel on twitter as well so until the next time take care bye